Hello, hello, everybody. Welcome back to episode six, I think, of Echoes of the Eye, Outer Wilds. We have a solid plan for today, surprisingly, which I'm pretty sure will actually lead somewhere this time. So, without further ado, no more of me chitter-chattering, let's just get right on into it. Hope you enjoy the video. Hmm. Okay, so apparently we learned some things that I forgot to look at. Shrouded Woodlands, which is the one place that we went to, which actually, yeah. So the plan for today is just to go to the other two places. In the Mooseman homeland, I guess. So this is the area that we went to, a bunch, that says a dense forest along the banks of a river. I thank you for that insightful information. Secret passage. Oh, yeah. The light coming out of the vault gave me a vision of climbing a spiral staircase to a room near the top of a tower. One of the stranger's inhabitants pointed at a mural of the tower beneath a nighttime sky, then picked up an artifact and left the room. Sometime later, the lamps next to the mural went dark, revealing a secret passage. Yeah, I really don't know how to open that secret passageway. Subterranean Lake. That's what that is. Look at that. That is a cult right there. No doubt about it. I discovered a vast subterranean lake beneath the submerged structure. The sealed vault is rested, resting on the shore of the lake. There are three interfaces, each marked with one of the three symbols from the vault. I rotated the mechanism in front of the vault, causing it to strain against the chains holding it shut. Moments later, rays of green light spill out of the vault. Which, yeah, that was terrifying. But yes, so we need to figure out how to get into the secret passageway. Apparently more about the Shroud of the Woodlands, but I don't feel like doing that right now. So, we'll, we'll do that later. I think that's a record. Okay, so now I need a boat. Oh, whatever. Nope, nope, nope. Nope. Come on. Load faster, please. That was the dumbest way to die. Okay, go run, child. Okay, yeah, so if you all remember from last episode, the reason that one of them is gone is not because they were one short. They're in... I don't know. They're in the painting, I guess. So, there will not be one that will attempt to come murder us anytime soon, hopefully. <laughs> that is tall. Okay, I, I guess, good to know. Random... randomness. Now, this place is very interesting. Oh, oh, this is the entire village! Oh, this is gonna be fun. <sighs> I heard footsteps. I don't like that. Okay, so what I've concluded while I stand here in immense amounts of fear is that it's heavier than me, it's not me, and it's repeating. So, I think it's above me. Yeah, there's something up there. Hopefully they're friendly. And hopefully there's no one else like them. That is immensely disturbing. Oh! I hate this place. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. That's cool, though. Okay, uh, actually, I take that back. I do hate this place, but it is cool. Okay, that is just lovely. They're all in water. Mm. 
And this probably says, do not go. But I'm going to go. Oh. <laughs> There's a fork in the road. I'm gonna go this way. Oh, never mind. I'm not gonna go that way. Good to know, though. That's where the other side of that. Oh, okay. I, um, I gotta talk fast. That's where the other side of the scary thing was. But why did they leave an entrance to it open? Interesting. Yeah. Cool. I wonder what it looks like if you're not the one teleporting. I bet that looks really weird. Oh goodness, what is this? Okay, we have a choice now to go down or stay up here. I think I will stay up here for now. Oh wow, I'm an idiot. Okay, the entire landscape was tilted because the tower just tilted to the side. Okay. Very interesting. I still hear footsteps. Oh, but there is an upstairs. There is a very, very big upstairs. They're probably up there. Okay, we're good. Can you teleport from here? Oh. Where is that? Ah, another one of these. I feel like we're being forced to get on. So... That's... A very... Oh, hi there, buddy. How are you? How do I get out? Can I... Fun. Yeah! Oh, come on. The lights are still on. How? Because now I don't know if the ship log updates because I don't have my sh... Da -da -da. My sh... <laughs> my suit. See, it updated, but it never told me because... I don't have my suit. Well, I do have my suit with me. Oh, that's a cool name. Starlit Cove. I like that. A secluded village nestled within a cave. Cove. Oh my goodness. A candlelit tower sits atop a nearby island. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna try and destroy my ship as much as possible. Oh, I gotta get out. I gotta get out. I gotta get out. Run, run, run. That was- I achieved what I wanted to achieve. Now we leave. I'm going to pound the flesh out of that person who's step, stepping around above me. Before this, I was gonna say, oh, I think I'm overreacting, but no, I think my actions are completely justified. That stepping is really, really creepy. See what kind of mind game you're playing here? Actually, I don't. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I mean, like, that's good to know, but what do I do? There's, like, a guitar here? Okay, yeah, I can't do anything. Outer Wilds is not one to make mistakes or put things in just to be decorative. That's right, I'm looking at you, stick. And everything here is not at night time. It's all clear day. However, these don't have the weird thingadings. The glowy whatevers. 
Which is a bit odd. Time to go figure out how to confront the creepy walking people. I'm going to burn them alive with this fire. So, and there's also two elevators. There's elevators on every floor, actually. Hmm, well, yes, I think here's the way down, is right here. Okay, yeah. Okay, so I want to check something real quick. Okay, so whenever it's half past the cycle, there's a bunch of, like, screaming ghost ghouls, or something, I don't know. And, and it goes like, <laughs> or something. And I was like, oh, okay, maybe those creepy dudes went and, like, died or something. But they didn't. So, yeah, I don't know what those screaming ghoul ladies or ghoul beings are. Well, okay, I will not walk any closer. Why do they build things and then just tell no one to go near them? I thought maybe for a second I could get over there, but no. Whenever you see those things, you just get immensely slow, and there's no hope. Do you think I can just jump down? Ow. Oh. Shoot, now I'm stuck. Shiplog, shiplog, my favorite. I actually really do love the shiplog. It's just so satisfying to see something else appear on here. Ha, ah, here we go, okay. The well at the bottom of the village is guarded by a statue that activates an alarm bell when it sees me. Why does it slow me down, though? I feel like that may just be a game mechanic to stop me from doing anything stupid that should not be done in the right order because I think I've done almost everything out of order at this point. The middle one has a boat that can take me anywhere I want to go. Theoretically, I haven't gone on it yet so I'm not entirely sure, but I'm pretty sure it can. But first you have to face the wooden menace. The Technically the two wooden menaces that will not stop stamping their lovely feet. Coming a pretty good circular boat driver. This is like some sort of sophisticated non-recreational tube. I swear it'd be the funniest thing to see someone like being pulled by a boat, but instead of a raft, you're just riding around on this. That would be awesome. I want this. I want this in real life. I'm going to drive it around a lake and no one's going to tell me otherwise. This is actually like a really cool way to travel. Granted, it's like horrifying at the same time, but it's very clever and very, very unique. Come down, please. Please. I want to say hello and then burn you. Yeah, there, there's like no way up. I am at a loss to get up there. So we're gonna do the next best thing and just go floating around this island. Moon. It's probably a moon. I think it is a moon. I'm gonna go just go float around this moon on that little boat. Although technically I don't think I can control it. That's creepy. Okay. Okay, what were you? I feel like I'm gonna need this for more than just going fast. Although it is actually quite fun going fast. Hmm. 
think this is a replica of our good old friend, the Hidden Gorge. And I think you get down here, I bet you, by getting to the elevators up there. Where if I summon another one? <laughs> it's gone. That's fun. Yeah, because this is like a straight path. I cannot just wander around the water like I hoped I would. Oh my goodness. Okay. Hello. Where are those chains? Where where do they go? Goodbye. That is creepy. It seems like a horrible idea. Seriously though. Oh, oh wow. no. Real quick. Did you ever notice that every single time in Outer Wilds and Echoes of the Eye, the only time it loads is whenever you die? So really, everything is loaded at the same time, kind of. I just find that incredible, because usually there's loading screens everywhere. And for here, it's just seamless transitions, like through the valley, I guess. It's just straight through, like it's just black for a bit, and then it like loads, but there's no loading screen. It is insane. It is lovely. I'm going to now regret what I'm about to do. Ooh, gotta hurry. Hello? Oh, okay. Very spindly beings, aren't they? Bruh, I'm too short to look through there, I'm sorry. Hold up, I gotta process that. So technically, if you look through there, then they just took the inside out and then brought it downstairs because then we've been here uh, before. It's just inside, I guess. Cool. Speedily, my friend, we do not have much time left. Okay. Thank you, dear friend. You've been a lovely companion. Hmm. I love closed doors. Okay, they gotta have that conceal button for something, but I can't open this door, so that's that's kind of sad. You got this. Good job. Oh, oh yeah. Okay, so I'm right there. Cool. I believe we're back where we started. Except for that, that's new. One giant circle. Gone. Wonderful. One thing. I rode a raft through the bottom of a massive canyon. It looks like there are buildings set into the cliff face high above. It ain't endless, but yeah, that's... yep. I'll add more things to my to-do list by going to the new place, but... I don't care. I want to go to the new place. I'm a wonderful pilot, if you haven't already noticed. I feel like this is going to be the Endless Canyon one, although I'm not entirely sure. Okay, let's see what this one holds for us. Mm -hmm. Fun. 
This feels more like a meeting hall than an actual village. So I don't know if it's like a really fancy hotel. I'm convinced it's a hotel now. This is looking like a... Seriously? Is, it, is this an instrument where it's only got... Yeah, it's like an instrument with only one string. That's weird. Okay. Down or up? I'm gonna choose up. I hate the closed doors. Because I'd have to come back or find them all later. Like seriously, the amount of closed doors in this game. Okay. Fun. Look at that. Another that's like the fifth one I've seen. But yeah, this is this is definitely in the canyon. Obviously. Oh, it's like a little music place. That's cool. Oh, there's more stuff back there. Okay. Let's see how it is. Interesting. He must have been the leader of the hotel. Leaders of the hotel. Just sitting there, watching, doing something. I don't know what. Downward we go. Dining hall, maybe? Yeah, this is totally a hotel. I am convinced. Do not even try and convince me otherwise. This is a hotel. Goodness. Okay. Where are you? Okay, there's a hand down there, so we gotta get down there. Okay. I can do that. Yeah, okay, then I go back from up there. Goodness, this place is huge. The other place I could handle because I could, again, I could see everywhere and everywhere, everything and everywhere I could go. I hate all these locked doors. But here, it feels more like a murder mystery map, and I am not appreciating this feel. It is very pretty though. It would be nicer in the daytime, but can't have that, can we? You'll see what I see, right? Um, love that. Love that. Please don't come chasing me down. Please don't haunt me later. I really would appreciate that. Good sir! Pictures are gone, and there was a screaming sound. There was a screaming sound, and now he's going to chase me. Why did I disrupt his picture presentation? I should have left him. I hate this game. Okay, so there was a bunch of wispy noises. Hopefully that means that they left. I did not sign up for a mini horror game. You're in the hallways, aren't you? You little demon, you're in the hallways. I shouldn't. I'm sorry, I just dropped your pre picture presentation. Why is this room so big? I hate you. There's too many doors. I don't like all the doors. Now, if I remember correctly, this most likely just takes me down to where we just were, which was in here. And I am correct, so I'm just gonna go straight back up. I mean, this place is beautiful, don't get me wrong, but I really do not want to step into that giant open room. 
It's it's too open. I have to find a tree now. Lovely. Okay. Tree, I, I guess. Neck another thing to part of to do. Let's go find a tree. Okay, find a giant tree. I can do that, I think. Nope, I'm not going in there. That's where he was. I don't want to go in there. No thank you. No thank you. No thank you. This place is weird. I don't like this place. It's creepy. Like this staircase. <laughs> Goodness! <laughs> Why is he standing there? That scared me so much. <laughs> Hello? Why are you so tall? I am not concealing mine. You were not getting that. <laughs> not good for the future. If that one's hostile, then the other ones that are walking around are also not gonna be. Yeah, that that's not gonna be good for whenever we finally get up to the elevator, because if that one grabbed me my, by the neck, stared me in the eyes and blew out my light, why did I take a... Basically, they're gonna be bad news. I found a mural of a large tree on the bottom floor of the lodge. Oh my goodness, it's a hotel. Yeah, that's gonna be so much fun. I, w I really don't want to go back there. That is my least favorite place now. That is my least favorite place out of all the places that I've been to. Why was he just standing in the corner? That is creepy as heck. I don't like that at all. We found the moose men and they don't like us back. I don't know if it's because we're short and they have tall supremacy if they think I'm just an, a dumb idiot who's like hey you're not welcome here or if I call the moose men not quite entirely sure don't get me wrong I actually do love this game I hate being scared though fun things to come very very fun things very very fun things for you not so much for me that's fine I hope you enjoyed the video it it was fun. It's just me standing there, waiting to round the corner and have those tall beasts just grab me by the neck and blow the candle out. That's not the greatest thing to look forward to. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed this wonderful video where I just scared myself for basically the entire video. Hopefully I'll see you in the next video. You know what? Just come back. I'm forcing you to come back, watch me suffer some more. I'll see you all later. See you in the next video.